zoom instead I push the button instead there we go hello this is not a spring check and the big news today of course is wait, what was that that everybody agrees that they should raise taxes on the wealthiest one percent or was something like that or is it that oh Hollywood yes who they support for the president could have effect on their bottom line well, for now, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. We'll redo the first, we talk about the first one again, so. <laughs> so, is this news that, what, everybody wants their taxes to be raised on, on the, the Okay, wealthy? what happened was the Democrats and their allies did a poll that shows that, that the majority of the people in this nation, 60-some percent of the people, think that taxes should be raised on the wealthy that are already paying more taxes than anyone else. They said what makes the, the here's always when the Democrats take a poll you have to read the fine print, that the, uh, nearly 100% of the 49.9% that pay no federal income taxes whatsoever think that the people that are paying taxes, not just the wealthy but the people that are paying taxes, should pay more. And if you include 49% and the thing is only like 64%, it means that virtually everybody in the Democratic Party uh, agreed. And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, actually, like this time, it's the one thing that the left and right both do agree on 100% is that this should be a blowout for any Republican candidate because the president's negatives are bad, the economy's not working right, the unemployment figures are high, and they said there's only one person in the Republican Party you could nominate that couldn't, that has no, has a chance of losing to Obama, and that's Mitt Romney. I mean, first of all, I mean, this is the guy, he walks. He doesn't pick his feet up anymore. He looks, oh, he really? looks like he's pushing 70. He looks like an old man. Looks. He's old, he's tired, and people my age don't want somebody like that as president. So, Because they know what it feels like to be old. And they know that he can't, that, that, that uh, that's why the only reason uh, that uh, Romney is getting a nomination is because he conceded the, uh, the vice presidency to a younger man whom the party likes and is likable by everybody. I mean, it, it's... Uh, I mean, he even, he even tried to change the election rules so that he could decide what delegates were on the floor, that only delegates that supported him would be allowed. Well, the, let's put it this way, the Ron Paul people were unhappy, the Santorum people were unhappy, the, um, the Gingrich people were unhappy, and they got lots of support out there on the floor. That They were basically going to cause a floor fight this, the day that was going to be epic, uh, and, and Romney backed off on it, which means until tomorrow he still does not have the presidential nomination because the party really doesn't, the party itself does not want this man. Only the Republican establishment wants him because he's one of them. He's not one of anybody else. Whereas Ryan is one of everybody else and is going to, the only way he's ever going to get elected Romney is with Ryan as his vice president. And Texas delegates planning floor mutiny over RNC rules changes. Well, that was the mutiny I was talking about. They, they basically what they decided. Well, they decided they come to the conclusion that there would be no conclusion, and they won't bring it up. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean they still aren't going to try to get it done after this thing, but they are not going to bring it up about the letting the presidential nominee select the delegates because he's not the nominee, folks. And and Egypt PM says new constitution by late September. Well, they're trying to figure out how he's going to do that since the court system has said that everything he's doing is illegal. Uh, and the Egyptian, basically, the, the guy, okay, the Muslim Brotherhood by Egyptian law is not permitted to hold office in Egypt, and he's the head of the Muslim Brotherhood, which means his election was in direct uh, contradiction to Egyptian policy. And then he, he's firing members of the military that don't agree with him, and they're basically staying on because the court's, going, the court's on their side, it's not on his side. So it, the, the problem in, middle, in, in Egypt just gets worse, it doesn't get better. And Bear kills Denali backpacker and Park's first fatal mauling. Oh well, yeah, the guy was taking pictures, can you imagine that? The, the, rule, the rule is you are not to come within a quarter mile of any of the animals in the park, and he was up 
I mean, it, basically the guy was up close taking pictures of grizzly bears, and grizzly bears can get to be very unhappy when they're feeding. And what happens to the U.S. born kids after the parents are deported? Obama does nothing. The State Department just lets the, uh, the State Department lets, okay, if you're a Muslim or a Latin, you get to, you know, if you flee the country, you take the, uh, the kids with you, and this is, you know, so that's how it works. It's, if they're deported, it's, uh, if it's a deportation, it's called tough because um, the Ethan Gonzalez thing uh, shows you. Ethan Gonzalez, the rule in our nation is that if you make it to the shore, you get to stay here, but because his, uh, he, uh, because his parents were born in Cuba, one of them demanded the kid come back, so that's, they go with the parents regardless. That's the way the system mm -hmm. is. And kidney for Ohio transplant accidentally thrown in trash. <gasps> Oh. Yeah, basically, uh, it oh wasn't gosh. accidentally. They don't do anything accidentally in a the hospital. They just basically tossed in the trash can. What in the world happened? Well, they said it was an error, but unfortunately, the hospital has a history of errors. They just oh. up and decide that, you know, somebody that's working decides, I don't we'll care about it, and they dump the, the oh thing. Oh, my gosh. Which basically is a massive disaster that's because a it's not like... Well, what happens is somebody doesn't get a kidney or something. I know, like that. and usually somebody was waiting for the kidney. It's all scheduled, and it's yeah. Well, they can't. Uh, basically, what it does, it kills the person that was supposed to get the kidney. So. Oh, that's horrible. Well, because they get a new, they have to get another match exactly for that and, person. And and sometimes it takes years to find it. And that's right. And Lance Armstrong takes part in bike race at, amid controversy. Oh yeah, the, the, the basically Armstrong is basically on the attack against Barack Obama. They said this has backfired on Obama because he's made Armstrong more popular than he was before. You have to understand, the new guy that's the head of France doesn't give a damn what Barack Obama wants. That's right. There is no, okay, Barack Obama told his czar, take his medals away from him, titles away, because he doesn't support me. And uh, everybody knows that's what happened. The French government doesn't really care damn what this president thinks or what his czar thinks, because he, uh, okay, well, he, it has been said that he was doing that. Well, he found him innocent in a court of law. If he was innocent in the law, he can't be guilty elsewhere. And the, and the French do have a legal system. It's an old established legal system from the court of Hanrabi. If you ha if you can, if you ain't convicted, you don't pay for it. Mm -hmm. And Apple's well, and the other part is Lance Armstrong was probably good for them for turnout too. Yeah, <laughs> but it's like they really don't care what the U.S. says. No, about but it. they do care about. I mean, they've even bounced their own people for drug use. But if you cannot prove the guy took drugs, well. We have witnesses that will say that he did it. Well, tell us the name of your witnesses. Well, we, can, we have to protect them. The law is very specific. They have to come to court. They refuse to go to court. They refuse to go to the federal uh, court against, uh, against Armstrong. Therefore, they do not exist. They don't exist. It's just hearsay. And Facebook insiders can sell stock as lockup ends. Oh, yeah. Basically, the company is just tanking it. Facebook is an example of the world but most god awful thing. They said what happens is is the people that had all the stock are selling their stock and fleeing the country because they're afraid of Obama. And Dill's fatigue group on stock twenty seven percent down. Yeah, the group on uh, Angie's list, um, uh, Zaga, all of these things, all these tech stocks are just tanking because they never had any value to begin with and I have no idea why they were being purchased like they were. Neither do I. And Pinterest finally comes to Android and the iPad. Yay! I didn't know that. Yeah, it, uh, I thought that would interest you. I think I got a thing the other day about a Pinterest app for our, our Android, but I, I guess you didn't read that. I, okay, problem is, is here, here is material we get. I get it here, and by the time she gets it, it's there. Yeah. That's the problem because, because we get, you get a we're, lot we're of getting material. so much stuff every day. And soldiers and Marines punished for misconduct in Afghanistan. Yeah, they, uh, they were, and basically the soldiers were taking leaks on buildings. Oops. That the soldiers do that in every military. They do that <laughs> all the time. Family of alleged shooter horrified. Oh well, yeah, some fifteen year old. Okay. We okay, yesterday Obama, we've gotta stop we have to have serious gun control 
Uh, they have the biggest gun control legislation in the United States in, this, in the state of Illinois and in Chicago specifically. They can't control things because the guns are coming in from Canada, which they can't control. You know how easy it is to get weapons into this nation mm -hmm. that you don't, aren't supposed to have? You just simply come across Lake Superior with the guns and there's nothing to stop them. Oh, that's how you do it? Yep. Mm -hmm. And Syrian man threatens to blow up the Arab League. Yeah, you can bet on that. They're going to they're gonna <laughs> take the Arab League out because the, Mo the Muslim extremists want to take control of all those countries. And Isaac leads airlines to cancel New Orleans flights. Yeah, I don't know why, because it's just a bloody storm. I've been through storms like that. <laughs> and I've, I've seen Lake Poncha train with the water up to the bottoms of the bridge, folks. That's normal. It's a... Okay, then you build a city under 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 the sea level, you're going to get wet. Oh, that's true. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay, if everyone tells you that what you're doing cannot possibly be success, and there's never been a success before, there's no reason for you to think it's going to be a success this time. <laughs>